Hello everyone, today we are going to learn basic FreeCAD tutorial how to create simple 3D clamps with parametric tools. So you can go to parametric part and click create sketch. I will choose front plan or you can click on XZ plan. The next I will create the polyline. Okay, start from this point to here then move to the top press escape button to close and use the dimension to set the length into 30 millimeter and also in here 30 you can select these two lines and you can go to offset tools so you can use the offset but first I will move into here the toolbar to show the offset tools okay you can click this icons offset and then I will offset into one millimeter click OK now in here I will use the line tools to connect from this point to here also at this point Use trim tools to cut the lines and arch. You can click this tool stream. I will click to cut. Okay, also at this point and in the top here. Click close and the next use pad tools to convert into 3D. You can click this icon pad. We'll set for length into 20. Click OK. The next, I will select at this edge and you can click fillet tools to fillet with radius 10. And also, I will select another edge. We select at this edge. Click OK again to apply. Now, in another side, we can use another option you can select the top trace and then click create sketch so we can use the reference tools click this icon select the arch and i will create arch by using these tools from the center point click from this point to here and then move into this point the next i will use plan tools to create plan from this point to here and then click at this point so we show the redo then constraint you can delete once like i will select this constraint and then can press delete button click close now we can use uh, these tools to cut the object by using this cat okay like this click ok again and also in this face you can select cut cat in this option i will set the reference to reference and also i will create the holes in the center for this exercise you can cut against arch it's the arch tool from the center point click in this point move into here and then use polyline tools create polylines from this point to here then click at this point Next, you can click this constraint and delete. And also, we create circle from this point, center point, with diameter 10, and you can press enter again. Click close. And now you can use the tools, pocket tools, to create holes and cut the object. Click OK again. And in the bottom here, we create again sketch. Okay, I will use the reference, create circle with diameter 10, press enter. Now you can use pocket tools to create hole. So we create this uh, basic 3D clamp and you can change for the view into perspective view. So this perspective. And the next we can render this object. 
I will go to render tools. You can add by using the tools, click add manager, and then you can insert for the render tools. Okay, we show this the render option. I will set into POP Firai project and I will use this option, click open. You can go to model, so this is for the models. And I will go back into the part tools and I will select the packet. I will create a simple part, create copy, click here. So with that copy and then you can select these two objects go to render and then click this icon to create the rendering view so to be show for the rendering view the next for the materials you can click at this icon and then click create material i will choose carpent click OK. Now in material, you can click drop down menu, right click, and then click add texture. So it'll be show about the texture option. You can click and then go to data. There as a image tools, you can click. And I will use the texture image. This is as example. Click open. After it, go to render carpent and we can click for the edit material render settings. Use texture and click OK. The last, we can apply the texture into the packet. You can click this icons, apply material, choose the render carpent, click OK. To view the render, you can go to POVRI projects and then click this icons to view the render. So this is for the first view. Okay, we can edit. For the resolution, you can click PFRI projects. In here, the default resolution, you can increase by changing in here. Or you can set for denoiser, I will set into true. And sample into 20. And next for the texture, I will set for the scale 0, 0.05. Now oh, we can go back into POP or Firai projects and you can click render again. So this is for the first view. Okay, that's it for basic pre-cat tutorial how to create 3D clamps with parametric tools and rendering. If you have any question about tutorial, you can comment below this video.